I just wanted to do a really quick little demonstration for you that you can try at home to sort of prove to yourself this whole thing about horizontal projectile motion. The idea being that it doesn't matter how fast something's moving horizontally, if something drops from vertically originally at rest, it, they'll all hit the ground at the same time. It's something that I know it doesn't seem to make sense that um, if you drop a football while throwing a football exactly horizontally, that they would both hit the ground at the same time. Mostly because, to be quite honest, if you throw a football, even without doing it on purpose, you're going to actually be throwing that football at a bit of an upward angle, and that changes things, even if you're trying to throw exactly horizontally. Um, even more crazy sort of sounding examples, um, you shoot a rifle, and at the same time that you shoot the bullet, you drop a bullet, both of those bullets will hit the ground at the same time. A bullet just doesn't travel horizontally forever and ever and ever and ever. It drops to the ground. The difference is that it's moving so fast that usually it'll hit something, you know, an object or something in the way before it hits the ground. So usually we don't think of that. But an example of a, a quick way that you can kind of show this to yourself is uh, get a business card, just any old business card, and fold it, first of all, in half. like that, and then fold up the edges, until you've got something that looks like this, okay? I've just got it folded so that it's uh, got a couple of little sides sticking out, okay? Now I'm going to put onto this a couple of coins, uh, pennies, dimes, whatever. Works better usually with uh, lighter coins because they're easier to flick, but you could use loonies, I guess, if you can afford them. Now, what you do is, you've got these set up so that the two coins are right flat on the card, and touching, whoops, so I drop one, I'm back, right on the edges there. Now, what we're going to do is, we're going to actually hold it on one end here, but flick it with our finger on the other side. Now, when I flick it like this, this coin on this side will have the paper move out from underneath it and it's just going to drop straight down. This coin over here is going to get shot off at an angle, right? It's going to have you know, some horizontal velocity at first. And we would expect that both of them should hit the ground at the same time. Now it might be a little bit hard for you to see it when you do it, uh, but mostly you just listen for the sound of it and you should hear both of them hitting ba -bing, ba -bing, you know, hitting the ground at the same time. So don't do it on carpet, it won't work as well. Try to do it on lino or something like that. But let's try it and see how well this works for me. Yeah, they hit the ground at the same time. One of them was bouncing against a garbage can over there also, but they both hit at the same time. Okay. Don't expect it to be perfect because um, you know, usually if, if you even just wiggle it a little bit, one of the coins might hang on to the card, card for a second. But if you try doing it a few times, you'll probably find that you do get pretty good results with both of them, bang, getting at the same time. Okay, good luck with that. Have some fun.